Hello everyone, it is Miss Madison here and today we are making a butterfly wind sock. Now this is not an original craft, I got it from iheartcraftythings.com so you can check them out if you want to make a uh, bumblebee wind sock or a ladybug wind sock. But today we are focusing on the butterfly wind sock. So let's get started. You'll need four pieces of construction paper. You need black and white but you can choose the other two colors, I chose green and purple. You need glue, scissors, a pencil, a sharpie or a black marker, a stapler, some tape. Um, I chose to use packing tape, but you can choose any type. Some pipe cleaners. I made these by twisting two pipe cleaners together. Some streamers and any colors you want, but I had green and white. You can also use star stickers or some jewels. Um, these are optional though. They're just to decorate your wings and you also need assorted markers to decorate your wings. So that's what you need. You also need a ruler, but I will show that in a later step. So the first thing we wanna do is make our butterfly wings. So we're gonna take our green construction paper and fold it in half hamburger style. Once it's folded in half, we're gonna make our butterfly wings on here. You should make your butterfly wings at the fold here and draw it outward so that you can make two at once. So I'm just gonna draw a butterfly wing. So here is my butterfly wing. As you can see, I went through some trial and error with it, but it doesn't really matter. Your wing can look however you want it to. So for this wing, we're just gonna cut along here and out here, uh, making sure not to cut this part. Okay. This is what my wings ended up looking like. And as you can see, they're even on both sides, which is exactly what we wanted. So now you can actually start decorating them. So I'm just gonna take my jewels, my stars, and these markers here and just decorate them however I want to. I am gonna make both sides of the butterfly wings look about the same, but it doesn't really matter. So I'm gonna add a star to both sides of here and then probably a star down here and some of these jewels around it and then just make some designs with the markers. All right, so I decorated my wings. Now I'm just gonna set that aside and we're gonna get started on the butterfly. Okay, so now we're just gonna take our purple construction paper, our ruler, and our streamers, and we're just gonna measure out an 11 inch strip of streamer. So I'm going to measure out as many of those until I can cover this edge of the paper with streamers. And I'm just gonna alternate colors. So do that first. So once I finished cutting them all out, I made sure they were even, not at the top so much, but it was more important they were even at the bottom here. I ended up cutting out about seven of them and I just arranged them so that they fit on the paper. And then I taped them down. After I taped it down here, I realized I had a little bit of excess at the end here. So I just cut that part off. So now that I have that part done, I'm gonna take my pipe cleaners and we're gonna make the little antennae. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna wrap this around my finger. I'm gonna start at the base of my index finger and just wrap it around. Now I'm gonna pull it off and I have one antenna done. That's one, I'm gonna set that aside. And I'm gonna do the same thing with the other one. Start at the base of my index finger and then just now I have two antennas. So next we're going to attach it to the butterfly itself. On the same side as the streamers, I kind of just arranged these until they were in the middle of the paper and I was happy with their position. Then I taped them down. So once everything's taped down on this side, we're just gonna flip the paper over so that we can work on that side. Okay, so once your paper is flipped over, we're going to be making eyes and then a mouth for the butterfly. So. After that, you're just gonna take your white construction paper, your pencil, and your marker, and you are going to draw your eyes. You can use the black construction paper for this step, but it's optional. Um, I'm gonna use the Sharpie. So what I'm gonna do on here is I'm just gonna draw one circle, and then I'm going to fold it over, and then cut it out, and I'll have two circles. So there's my circle. And again, I'm just gonna fold the paper. and I'm gonna cut this out and I'll have two circles. Here are my two circles and I'm just gonna draw the pupils in with my black marker. Now here are my two eyes and I'm just going to put this on the paper and then I'm gonna draw them out. I 
I just arranged the eyes so that they were directly under the pipe cleaners and then I glued them down and I drew a mouth with a sharpie. Okay, so now you should have something that looks like this. Okay, we're going to fold it around and we're just gonna staple the back of this. So what you want to do is only use two staples on either side. So right here, we're going to staple once up here. Oh, make sure everything lines up before you staple it. Ooh. Did two staples here. And now we're gonna do two staples down here. There's our two staples here. Two staples up here. So now it should look like this. It looks kind of weird because it doesn't have its wings yet. And that is the next step. We are going to add its wings. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna cut down the center of the wings and just put them on either side. So I'm just gonna tape either wing on here so that they are fully displayed and you can see them. And then we just have one more step and we're done. So at this point, our butterfly is looking pretty good, but now all we have to add is a little handle. So we're gonna take our black construction paper and create a handle. So I cut this black piece of construction paper out that is about seven inches. And I'm just gonna put it inside of the top part of the butterfly and we are going to staple it on either side, just so it looks like this and you can hang it anywhere. And after that, you are all done. That is your butterfly wind sock. Hope you enjoyed this craft.